So I'm still having this problem with the Google Play Store. Check your connection and try again. And I know I'm definitely connected. And uh, I've rebooted, I've done this, that and the other. And still not working. So I guess I'm gonna have to try the old uh, sign out of my Google account on this phone, sign back in all that kind of stuff. Um, so if I go to accounts, you can see there's all the, uh, the accounts that are assigned on the phone. Google is there. And uh, oh, rather interestingly then, it does have um, a sync error. So let's uh, see if we can sign out. So I'll remove the account. Removing this account will delete all of its messages, contacts and other data from this phone. So from the phone, but obviously not from or the cloud, from you know, from the internet or you know, so it's still on my computer my computer and devices will still be able to access it. So that's removed. Um this is interesting, so it's now locked the phone, so I guess I just need to uh, respawnables has stopped so the game I wasn't even playing has stopped that's okay fair enough um, well let's uh, authenticate shall we so I'm gonna put my uh, email address in here Basically, I'm just signing back into uh, the Google account. Um, okay, so it's now asking me for my password, which I shall put in as well. Hopefully, I can remember what it is. Okay, so I got my password right. And uh, so this is now almost like signing in for the first time again. Uh, oh, it's my Xperia. Well, that's interesting. Uh, so this is the protection on the phone. Let's see what happens here. You can see this is heading for a factory reset, isn't it? Dum de dum de dum. I have no idea what it's loading. Uh, locate your Xperia if you lose it. I thought I'd already activated this, but so okay. So it's because I've signed out. The phone's gone a bit crazy. I've signed out of my Google account, and obviously everything's going wrong. But it's handling it relatively uh, graciously. So this is the bit. So this is the bit where I want to re-add my Google account. So I'm just gonna again going to put in my Google account um, credentials just bear with me for a moment it's quite a long you know if you have a long password it makes it much more difficult for people to guess doesn't it and the more random it is as well so and then put that in And then uh, hopefully I've got my password right. Um, where am I? Okay, so next. By signing in, you agree to the term. Yeah, it's just all the usual stuff. Of course, I accept it. Checking some info. Thanks very much. Google services. These services put Google to work for you. So again, it's because I've signed out of my Google account. I'm now signing back in. It's almost as if it's a new phone. Um, okay, that's fine. Well, you know, and I can see actually there's something going on up here, it looks like the Play Store. Ok, 
Okay, so Play Store, the Google framework is, seems to be working. Let's see if the Play Store is working. Yes, it is. So that seems to have fixed it. Whether there be any other ugly things happening on the phone, I don't know. But I think, um, just to be sure, I will restart the phone completely and uh, make sure we log in without any weird things going on. So this is the Sony Xperia Z3 Plus in the aqua green. Nice kind of feel in the hand, nice and light. Buttons down the side there. And dedicated camera button, which is really useful. Let's see if we can get a close up on that. Not really in focus. Um, actually, filming this with a Xperia Z2. It was actually the Z2 that persuaded me that uh, the Sony Androids were the Androids for me. So, uh, kind of cross graded to the Z3 Plus. Well, it seems to have booted up okay. Let me just uh, log into the Smart Launcher. This is kind of my uh, Zen mode for my launcher. See the reflection there as well. I'm recording this on the STM is it STM10 plugged into the Z2. Anyway, a bit of a sidetrack. We really want to know if Play Store is working, don't we? So that's a shortcut. See, let's use the actual icon so you know I'm not doing anything weird. So there's Play Store, the icon. Oh, what does it say? By using oh, so it's kind of reset stuff, isn't it? Um, I really don't want to be kept up to date with crap in my inbox. Thanks. Um, so that appears to have worked again. It looks a bit different. What's going on? Uh, so okay, let, let me just kill everything. Let's get rid of all that. So I normally use the smart launcher shortcut, which is that one up there. And uh, yeah, there's something. I don't, know, I don't know if something's changed or not, but it's basically there, isn't it? Um, so there we go. Uh, don't know why Nat West have sent me that. Anyway, uh, it kind of seems to work, doesn't it? You can kind of like to install, yeah. So uh, there you go. That's how you uh, get back into Play Store. Um, although it does confuse the phone a, a little bit by the looks of it. But I'm sure it's nothing it can't recover from, and it's easier than a full factory reset. Well, I think it is anyway, but then I would, wouldn't I, because I've just done it. 